We have a new iPod Nano for this holiday season. Let me show it to you now. This is it right here. It's really, really beautiful. And it combines, it combines the best of both worlds, the portrait aspect ratio that people loved, and the same, exactly the same, super high-res display in portrait mode. And yet, it is the thinnest iPod we've ever made. It's got an enhanced user interface with some really nice features. We've taken the accelerometer from the iPhone and the iPod Touch, and we've brought it to the iPod Nano. And it does some wonderful things. And you can actually create genius playlists right on the Nano itself, even when it's not connected to iTunes. So, Let's take a look at some of these user interface enhancements. With this high-res display, you can have beautiful, nice, long menus. This is what it's like to look at songs now. We're displaying the albums they come from. And with the accelerometer, you just turn your iPod Nano sideways. You're in cover flow. It's really nice. And then pick a song and go back there. You get full-size album art. Now playing screens, again, with photos. Just turn the Nano to see a photo in landscape mode. Video is fantastic on this high-res display. And uh, another cool thing is you push and hold down the center button. You get a pop-up menu. And you can start a Genius playlist right on the iPod Nano. You can add songs to album on the go. You can browse the album. You can browse the artist all just by holding that center button down. And this is, when you start a Genius playlist, you can see it right on the iPod Nano. You can refresh it, and you can save it for later. It's very, very nice. We have extras that we normally ship, calendar, stopwatch. There's even a voice recording program on, so when it detects a microphone, you can record voice notes to yourself. It's very, very nice, and if you'd like, I'd love to show it to you. And now, there I am, listening to that. And I can push down the center button. And I can even start a genius playlist based on those songs right there. It's created it for me right on my iPod. There's a Donovan song. <clears throat> Go to the next one. And so it's taken the songs that I have on my iPod, and it's made a genius playlist right on the go, not connected to iTunes or anything else. Now, one other really cool thing about the accelerometer is we have a new feature called Shake to Shuffle. So you just take your iPod, shake it, and I just turned on Shuffle. I didn't really want to tell you I had Dean Martin on my iPod, but <laughs> if you don't like that song, just shake it and you'll get another one. Isn't that cool? So shake the show. Okay. So let's go back and uh, we'll go to uh, just photos. I just want to show you that too. And let's see. Yeah, Zach a Lake. Here's some photos and Again, we can just thumb through the photos. They're beautiful high-res display. And of course, it won't take too long before we get to one in landscape. And again, we just tilt the unit, go to landscape, and take a look at some photos there, and you know, back to portrait here. And it just works really, really well. So that's what I wanted to show you on the iPod Nano.